Hiya, cowboy. Hey, you know no one believes what Kane said about you, right? Yeah, of course. He's just trying to push my buttons. It's not working, is it? Nah. What is getting to me is that I never know where he's gonna be. I only get to fight his horrifying, death-dealing robots. Yeah, wish we could get him to use some of those horrifying, death-dealing robots for good. Wish all you want, Jules, but that ain't gonna happen. He's bad to the bone. It's ready! Presenting my latest creation, Jacob's Seaweed Slab. As much as I'd like to stick around for dessert, I gotta get back to Deluxe. Running late for my intern shift. Don't want to keep Caneco waiting. Can't risk losing our inside connection. <laughs> yeah. Mike, we need to talk. Just came across something crazy over here. Sort of in the middle of something here, Jules. Wait, where are you? <laughs> Maybe the next time someone says, turn around, you might want to, I don't know, turn around? Pretty clear on that now. Hey, any way you can hack into these pods? I'm on it. Don't go anywhere. It shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> yeah! Get those gophers! Okay. <sighs> hey, Julie. Hi, Tooley. Hey, our names rhyme. Julie. Tooley. I'd love to talk about that right now, but I'm locked out of my pod. I'm using the latest security code uh, 98876. Well, there's your problem. You're using the wrong code. <laughs> there's a new one. Came online just before the announcement. It's 77764854. What's the number that looks like a Z? It's a 2, Tooley. 2! That's it. Thanks, gotta go. <laughs> that walrus is stupid. Got the prison pod codes. I'm in. That's great. Here it goes. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. We're running out of time here. I don't know if I can get control of the pods, but I think I might be able to get the force field down. Do it. Oh, you won, Jules. I'll take it from here. And furthermore, I promise that I'll be tripling my efforts in our war against the Burners. And soon, their Motor City will be no more! I wonder if he'll ever wake up. Guys like him never change. Trust me. You don't know him like I do. Hey, man! She's ready! Anyone up for a ride? Retract the nose cone, Julie, lean against the turn, and Texas, stop pushing! And three, two, one! Killer jump, guys! Floor it! Mike, come again! He can't hear you! He's trying to get this thing down! He's gonna try to wear a gown! He said bring it down! Why did you cut me off? Whoa, easy. Nothing was with me. I just, I don't know. Things are getting crazy out there. I can't take any chances, all right? I just, I don't know what I would do if something happened to you guys. After everything with Dutch? Who does that guy think he is? 
Kiss my gators. The guy's clearly insane. I'm just glad we got out of there. Can I get the triple jalapeno burger with the fries and onion rings? Oh, and a side salad. Watching my weight, so... <laughs> you the burners? Yeah? You're gonna wish you wasn't born. <laughs> get out of here. Not leaving. It'll be safer. I can handle this. Seriously, what's going on with you? Hey, I'm talking to you. Ah, uh, guys, he's talking to us. It's my job. I'm talking to you. Get out of here now. I'm not leaving. Told you we could take care of ourselves. Come on, let's get you back to your cars. It's enemies. Someday, huh? Yeah, tell me about it. Ah, it's cracking! Hey, Mike, you okay? There was something that guy said. He knows about me. Knows what? He knows about my past. Somehow, he's connected to it. I, I just can't figure it out. Oh, whoever he is, he keeps coming back. How are we supposed to stop these bots with him always getting in the way? You're right. I gotta find this guy. Deal with him once and for all. Texas is coming with. I got a score to settle. Okay. Engage neck muscles. No. Oh. All right, Texas, you're with me. Yeah! Jules, you and the others, track down those bugs. On it. I think we better find a plan B. Guys, we've got a problem. Oh, don't worry, he'll learn. I mean, hey, you. Um, what's up with the car? You know, it's, it's just resting. Whatever, uh, you need to see this. Sunday, 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 Sunday. The Duke of Detroit presents Carnage Mayhem. I think it's great what you're doing for Chuck. Technically, it's not cheap. I mean, what am I doing for Chuck? You're being a good friend. Risking your car just to help Chuck win some self-confidence. I mean, it's sweet. I just hope you know what you're doing. Hey, Mike. Oh, hey. <laughs> Why aren't you watching with the rest of us? We're just over there. Uh, you know, uh, superstition. Superstition? <laughs> yeah, I, I stood here yesterday and he won, so... You know, you know what? It, it's a guy thing. That's, uh, uh... Yeah, that's odd. Fine, I promise. It doesn't matter who's driving his car, so long as I'm driving yours. Texas bet his car, too? I couldn't stop him. Why not? Trust me, okay? Chuck can't lose. He lost the last race. Have you even thought about what happens if Chuck wins? The only thing crazier than the Duke is his temper. Think about it. There used to be another exit. Hey, look at this. The kids have to be in one of those rooms. If we can find a way past that thing, we can rescue them and then get the heck out of here. Think you can buy us some time? Do you even have to ask? Hey! Ugly! Over here! Mission accomplished. Kane's got a few less citizens to kick around in Deluxe. Oh, yeah, it was great until the part where you forgot to show up. Thankfully, I totally bailed us out. Hiya! I tried, guys. Really. Hey, we made it. But those new Sector Enforcer drones are pretty nasty. Gonna be tough to keep this up if we can't find a way to get rid of them. You don't suppose you need somebody to snoop around to find out where Kane's making these things so we can shut it down? Yeah. If only I knew somebody with that kind of access. I'm on it. Hey, you know you can count on me. I know. Looks kinda hairy to me. Nah, man, you're hairy. This, this is just plain scary. So dangerous, no humans are even allowed inside. Uh, if I wasn't completely terrified, I might be kind of impressed. Nice job snagging these files, Jules. Anytime. Yeah, must have been pretty hard to get a little file out of one of those things that has files in them. Almost as hard as it's gonna be to smash this place. You know, you can come see how it's done if you're not too busy up top being Mr. Lux. Ease off. Jules is one of us. Yeah. But it might not be a terrible idea to have a backup plan in case we're down a guy. Or a girl. Come on, guys. You serious? No, I get it. You needed me and I wasn't there. But I'm no Mr. Lux. I'm a burner. 
and I'm gonna prove it to you. You don't need to prove anything. I'm taking out the drone factory alone. <laughs> what? That's crazy. Hey, wait up! Jules, you can't do this by yourself. I can if I'm wearing this. Whoa! What is it? It's a safety suit. Don't worry, it'll protect me. Jules, wait. Come back. And we're actually ahead of our synthesoid quotas. Attention! Safety suit deployed in Motor City. Oh, got one already? A burner! Oh, this is going to be fun. Come on, Jules. Entering external control mode. Uh, uh, I'm not doing this. Oh, I am glad you changed your mind. Now let's talk this out. No, 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 no. I am not doing this. Jules? <laughs> What's going on? Uh, Jules? Hey, whoa, whoa! Just try to kill us. Man, am I glad to see you. Funny way of showing it. Sorry. Don't sweat it. I got it all under control. Oh, Tuli, I tell you, this is the next best thing to pummeling that traitorous cadet in person. Pummel him good, Mr. Kane! So, uh, that whole trying to prove I'm a burner thing isn't working out quite the way I planned. Really? This isn't what you were going for? Ah! Okay, all right, that one I maybe deserved. Hey, Mikey, looks like your plan is working. Great! Let's get Julie back to HQ so we can get the suit off of her. I'm running out of snot for her to beat out of me. Anybody ever tell you you fight like a girl? Sorry. That's being controlled by an evil dictator? No more jokes. You gotta go. It's over. It's not over until I get you out of here. <laughs> Finally. You got us into this. I can't let you pay for it. You have to go. Motor City needs you. Or you can find someone else to help you steal files and make holograms. I'm not leaving, and the burners need you. I think I've proven I'm the last person the burners need. something what is it I'm really I'm really Mike! Mikey! Safety overload! Uh come again? Julie soup! You have to overload it! It'll shut down if you damage it beyond its protection threshold! So how much damage are we talking about? A lot! Ridiculous amounts! Right! Damage it! Piece of cake! The Enforcer drone factory! It'll totally overload the suit! Too dangerous! More dangerous than this? You got a point. Okay, let's do it your way. What? Nice one. You know I do what I can. Not only did my suit go...
crazy, but Chuck hugged me. Wait a minute, are you saying you don't love the Caneco safety suit? <laughs> yeah, it's not as great as I thought, but it's still way better than that gross old school stuff you guys wear down there. So how much longer are you gonna mess around with this double life stuff? Can't keep it up forever. I know, but for now, I'm just gonna enjoy the win. Hey, Jules, what was it you were trying to tell me earlier? You know, when Kane was about to snag us and obliterate us and everything? It can wait. Totally. Check this out. Got you a present. Aw, oh, you bought me jewelry. You shouldn't have. Eh, I know how you like to accessorize. It's a booster. Apparently new and improved. Standard issue for all of Kane's new Ultra Elites. So, what does it boost? Everything. Makes you quicker, faster, don't feel pain. And yesterday, Kane added a new wrinkle. It also eliminates fear. With that stuff, you're... Invincible. At least now we know what we're up against. What do you mean that's not Julie? She's a girl. Well, now we got two of them. <sighs> it's Claire. Totally different person. Please. Ugh. Really wish I could go. But, already have plans. <laughs> Staying here for some major girl time with Jules. Ow! Hey, Claire, we'll be back in a few. Keep handing out candy. Wait, where are you going? To find Texas. He's not answering his comm. Need to make sure he's not overdoing it on the candy. You remember last year. So, about the cablers... Huh. Got anything, Jules? No sign of him. Probably got his head stuck in a pumpkin again. Whoa! If this is someone's idea of a prank... Hey! Okay, not funny. Mike, I think somebody's trying to... Mike, can you hear me? Great. Buddy, I'm keeping you close. <laughs> Whatever this stuff is, it's clearly messing with your head. And if they got you with it, and tried to get me, Julie! Come on, Jules, where are you? Julie! I just I didn't. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. No, no, you, you can't be here. He's got eyes everywhere. Oh, no. Chuck, Dutch, Terrors are back. Oh, no. Hey, hey, buddy. Watch out for the blood-sucking licorice. <laughs> Hang in there, guys. Kane's coming for me. No, he's not. The stuff the terrorists got you with, it's bringing out your fears, making you see things. But why are they doing this to us? These lollipops hate me! Payback? For putting the brakes on their last plan for Deluxe? Or to keep us from stopping their new one? We gotta find them! Ladybug. Talk to the Ladybug. <sighs> ladybug. <laughs> ladybug? Is this nonsense, or are you trying to tell me something? Follow the bug. <laughs> I'm gonna go with nonsense. Bug! Bug! Bug. Bug. Bug! You put a bug on him! Good work, Jules! Looks like they're up at the Motor City ceiling. I'm disappointed, Julie! Well, I'm sorry, but I've gotta keep on fighting for Motor City! Big news. Kane got pulled into some huge meeting that's gonna last all afternoon. He'll be out of his office all day long. Jules, you are the best. Mm -hmm. I love you, Babs. Okay. There you go. Just remember to change the fluids every six months. You were right, Julie. I guess this is better than building a giant shark. Just look at all those beautiful, shiny driving machines. <laughs> Thanks for covering our butts today, Jules. 
Rapid firing Kane's plans to us like that. I knew you were intense, but... Yeah. Didn't know I had it in me. Yeah, well, keep it up. Hey, Jules. So how's it going? Oh, great. Just sealed in down here, having a blast. Any chance you can work up some of your magic and pop open one of these exits? Not without my magic cane code terminal. So you're saying we're on our own? Let me see if I can come up with something else. In the meantime, be careful up there. Aren't I always? Not no. Now. Point taken. Come on, Jules, we gotta go. <laughs> Looks like we're too late. Hey, you all right? Yeah, great. Never better. The Amazons were the only ones not there tonight. Well, that doesn't make them guilty. Well, makes them a good place to start. You sure about this plan? They'll never buy it if I just walk in. Get me closer! before we know it. If our weapons can't scratch it... Maybe Vegas can. You saw what this guy did to these bots. Would that kind of weapon work against poly... whatever you said? It'll do more than what we got. Then we better find this guy before Kane does. Let's get ready to move. Jules, I'm gonna need you to stay behind on this one. What? Why? I need you to find out everything you can about this Genesis pod in case we can't find Vega. I can do it when we get back. Jules, I need you to not fight me on this one. You saw the kind of firepower Kane's sending after this guy. If something happens to us... Why does everyone keep saying that? Look, if something goes wrong, I need to know there's still someone who will fight for Motor City. Mike, nothing is going to happen. Will you do it? <sighs> Fine. Thanks, Jules. You. I need your help. Motor City needs you. enough to believe in a myth like Vega. Looks like I was wrong. Then I want what I was promised. All of it. And you'll have it. If you hurt my friends. <laughs> I don't care about your friends. Without you, everyone will run back under the rocks like cockroaches. There'll be no one left to stop me from taking Motor City by force. You're wrong, Kane. Well... Even if I am, it'll be mighty tough for them to do much without their cars. They're all yours. Mike! You shouldn't be here. Access denied. You have to get out of here. If they catch you... Come on. <sighs> They're gonna be back any second. Good. Let them find me. Access denied. <sighs> Julie, blowing your cover won't help me. Access denied. <sighs> well, I don't know what will. 
Do you know why I asked you to stay behind the other day? To watch your back. Look where that got you. I knew that if something happened, you'd be able to pick up the pieces. me to. I asked you to? Uh, yeah, and then he tried to make a move, so I, uh, I hit him. Oh, Thule, it was so scary. There, there. Thule's gotcha. How could you? Isn't it even possible to break someone out of a Kanko maximum security cell? Of course it's possible. I mean, it's not going to be easy. Security breach. Sector 9A. Escaped prisoner. Okay, so maybe it's easier than we thought. I know you want to help, but I don't think... Just jump! Uh, Jules? Jules? You can never just stay put and wait for a rescue, can you, cowboy? Part of my charm. I think you forgot something. Thanks, Jules. Chuck! Chuck! I've got Mike! What's your status? Mike? Mike? Mike! Oh, you're back! Now help us fix this. We hit the Genesis pod with Bessie. Bessie? Oh, that's what we're calling the weapon. But the pod's defenses just heal itself! We're gonna have to take out the control module. Where's that? Kane's war pod. Well, is there any way we can get inside? I can think of a way. Mike, take me hostage. Kane will give you anything to get me back. Kane doesn't care about anyone enough to make that deal. Trust me. He does. Hello, Abe. Chilton! Where did you... How did you... I have someone I think you might like back. A hostage? <laughs> we both know you'd never hurt a civilian. I would if it was for the greater good. You taught me that, Kane. I'll give her back when you turn off the Genesis pod. Her? Help! Please! What? If you hurt her, well, I guess that's up to you. I can't believe this is working. Let's get on with it, Chilton. It's simple. I'll send her over. She turns off the Genesis pod, and then I'll surrender. No escapes, no protests. And what happens if I don't agree to your terms? Don't tell me you came all the way up here with just a bluff. One more step and I'll drop her. No, you won't. You don't have the stomach for this. Ah! Ah! No! No, wait! I'll do it! Just don't hurt her. Please! If I didn't know you better, I'd almost believe you cared. I'm so sorry, Dad. It's okay. You'll be safe soon. Though, didn't we?
Hey, sorry, buddy. Hey, Jules. I never knew you meant so much to Kane. You must be a really good intern. He's my boss, that's all. He was my boss, too. I'm not sure I'm following you. It's nothing, just... Just don't get too close, you know? It'll only make it harder in the end. Actually, Mike... Tell me we get to go home now. The sooner the better, buddy. Dutch has got to get started on my new ride. I already got a list of improvements we can make. Of course you do. I don't know about you guys, but I could go for one last ride before we go home. <laughs> Oh, now where's the fun in that?